Hello friends, welcome again and this is my new project online Dr. Finder and uh, this project I have developed in PHP and MySQL the version for the PHP I am using is the PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6 for connecting the PHP and MySQL I am using the MySQL I and for creating the database and uh, I am running this project on the Jam server but if the WAM server or the other uh, PHP and Apache server then you can configure and run this project on those server also right this is a web based project and uh, that's why for front end development i am using the html css and javascript and some of the jquery library also i have used for giving some good effects inside the project like a slider running on the home page this is a jquery plugin for form validations for date plugin i am using the html i am using the jquery plugins right so let's start with the functionality go through so the project title is online doctor finder and it's a major web based php and mysql dbms project right so this is the home page of the project you can see the doctors are coming on the home page and uh, these doctors are coming from the database if you click on the view details then you will be able to see the details of the doctor and if you want to book the appointment you can book the appointment too but for booking the appointment you must have the login inside the system right so this is symptoms okay you can uh, search the doctor according to the symptoms right so uh, and all the doctors which belongs to that symptoms will you will be able to uh, find the doctors according to that right this is about this is a fine doctor and let me show you the symptoms if i click on the heart then this two heart uh, doctor belongs to the heart disease and you can see this is a specialization in heart right so this is a fine doctor and it's a real time search if you search it then you will be able to find the doctors according to your symptoms right you can view the details you can book the appointments this is a patient registration as i told you earlier without uh, login id and password patient will not be book the appointments of the doctor right so this is a registration and uh, according to the registration he, patient can generate his user id and password and he will be able to log inside the system using that user id and password this is a login and there are three types of login patient login and the doc admin login and the doctor login right and each and every uh, login has their different dashboard right this is a contact us right and this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database right so let me go with the patient login first so this is a patient and the patient user id is patient and test so this is a patient right so now i am going to book the appointment of a doctor this is a book appointment appointment date time slot this one 10 to 30 and he can put the card name for making the payment this is a dummy payment and no need to enter the valid card details and once you click on the make payment then you will get your okay, appointment confirmation and these are details right so patient had booked the appointment for that doctor patient can also uh, book a new appointment and uh, and uh, so like i am i have a heart and uh, less than 100 uh, less than 1000 cost and the location i am looking for the sector team right so this doctor belongs to that criteria and if you click the that details then you will be able to see okay and these are my appointments all of the appointments who has booked earlier will be displayed here right this is a my account section of that patient right and the patient can update his account details and update his account details into the database right this is a logout once patient log out then above administration will will not be displayed right now i am going to log in as an admin okay so this is the admin so admin can add the new doctor from here Admin can add any number of doctors right so currently there are four doctors available but if you want to add more then you can add any number of doctors this is add new time slot from where you will be able to add new time slots this is a report and this is a doctor report and uh, you can see this is a doctor report this is the appointment report right all of the appointment reports which is available and we can delete it also so once click on the delete then you can see that appointment has been deleted right so this is a time slot report so admin can add any number of time slots. this is a change password for the admin 
from where admin will be able to update his account password and the logout now i am the login as a doctor so doctor user id is doctor at password test so this is a doctor doctor can update his account details and doctor can see his appointments only right and the change password doctor can't perform any operation so there are three types of user available in this product the first is a patient who can book the appointment and see the um, book the appointments make the payment and see is my booking right my appointments admin can add a doctor admin can add the time slot admin can see the all appointments admin can see the all doctors reports edit it delete it and admin can add the add the time slot also for doctors doctors can only and only see his appointments right and update his account details and password rights and log out so this all functionalities this is a three user based login system it means patient has their own dashboard admin has their own dashboard and doctor has their own dashboard and each and every functionalities of these users are different right right so this project uh, this functionalities have developed in, in this project but if you need more functionality in this project if you want to add more things inside this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to our requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest technologies Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.